matched shelves that we bought. Yeah. Some of it will be functional, like my inks, and some of it will be, like, just keep shit on the walls. Yeah. No, I think that's a good idea. Do you like that um, like layout? Are you... Would... Yes. Yeah. Because you have the to put the curtain wall will be there. Because yeah. the couch will be under this window. Right. But part of what I was thinking about is because, like, I like the couch here or here. But when I put the couch there or there, it shortens the room. Yeah, no, here is good. I think here is really good because it's, like, immediately you can throw your stuff. Exactly. Like, because as soon as I walk into a room with my purse and stuff, my brain is like, where can I put throw all of my yeah. shit? <laughs> also, it makes sense to me as far as the angle on the TV. Yeah. And yeah, then, then you can you can see it from here and you can exactly the chairs are very And the chair it. will go over here, but it's on rollers now so that I can, like, theoretically, I can pull it off the wall when I want to.
I'm running late. Love that. Um, I got pulled over on my way home from setting up Bella's shop. I'm not gonna talk too much about it because I don't, <laughs> I don't want the cops in my town to come after me, but basically in my town, they'll stop you and they'll say that your tail light is out when your tail light's most definitely not out when they think that you're like a suspicious driver. And the thing is I look 12. <laughs> And so the cop thought I was a minor out past curfew. I'm 24, so not a minor. Um, anyway, I didn't read yesterday because I was really tired after being out all night helping um, Bella. I listened to The Raven King, um, so I got pretty far in that. I'm almost done with The Raven King. Today, my friend is coming over and we are going to read Wild in the Moonlight and eat dinner. So, very exciting stuff. Um, yeah, I'm currently reading. I finished We Set the Dark on Fire. Very good. Very good. Thank you, Mads, for that suggestion. Mads is on Twitter and she provides me all the sapphic content that I need. Um, I... Also finished Gemina and Obsidio in the Illuminate Files. Really good. Want to own those books. Um, and what else? I, mm, I think that's all that I finished. I'm also currently reading The Raven King, City of Ashes, um, something else. Ironside from the Modern Fairy Tale series. So... I'm hoping I'm gonna finish The Raven King today and knock out a lot of The City of Ashes, but we'll see because I don't love the Shadowhunters books as of reading the first one. And there's like 15 of them. And I pre-ordered Chain of Gold and I was like very excited because I liked those books as a high schooler. Now that I'm rereading them, I'm like, no. So, okay, I'm gonna go to work. I hope you guys have a great day, bye. This is, this is the meal of champions. My former powerlifting coach and nutrition coach would be so mad at me. By the way, I used to powerlift. Um, these are so good though. They have ones with just cheese if you don't eat meat. Um, but these are really good. I think I could make them myself like in a mason jar, but I'm not going to. Also, very good, gluten-free. I eat these all the time. I eat these enough that when I'm not eating these, my coworkers are like, wow, amazing. So, you know. Also, I'm like really unhappy because um, one of the, I guess I like set a video to be in slow-mo mode <laughs> while we were doing Bella's shop. And so I just had to completely get rid of like 10 minutes worth of content. Not 10 minutes, I'm being dramatic. Like three minutes worth of content because it was in slow-mo mode and I couldn't even like speed it up so that it wouldn't completely destroy the file. <sighs> why would I Why would I put a video in slow-mo? I wish I could just turn that setting off because I wouldn't have a video on slow-mo. But here we are. I'm late, I'm so late. Late for me is anything less than 30 minutes early. <laughs> Thank you, parents and anxiety, for that trait. Love it. All my friends are like chronically late. And so I show up to the function 30 minutes early and they show up 10 minutes late. And I am just always like, you know that TikTok sound that's like, Doo -doo 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 -doo. I, that's what I feel like. Maybe I'll put it in the video. All right, I'm out. Bye. I am leaving work early because I don't feel well. I even look like I don't feel well. I don't feel well. Um, and everyone is like moving, which I'm really sensitive to sensory overload. I hate open workspaces for doing this. Um, everyone is moving though. And so, and they're moving to a spot next to where I sit. And so it's very loud and my head hurts. I haven't really slept in two days, so I'm very tired. Um, I'm going to go home and nap and clean and possibly film my TBR and wrap up. But my friend is coming over for dinner, so, and to read Woven in the Moonlight. So we'll see. 
I might have to cancel on her, but I don't want to cancel on her because I feel like every single time we try to hang out, something happens. That's not her fault and it's not my fault. There's always something and I'm like determined now. So, um, Natalie, if you watch this, this is for you. <laughs> um, but we'll see. I'm, we'll see. I'm going to head home now. Bye. <laughs>
On the plus side, Legendary, I have the digital version of on Scribd and the audiobook. So, um, like what I'm doing with Ironside, because I want to finish it, but I have other things I need to do, I've just been listening to it while like putting together my schedule and that kind of thing. So that's helping knock it out. I am probably going to do the same thing with Legendary, especially tomorrow when um, my friend works again. And so I will more than likely do it tomorrow too. I'm hoping to finish Legendary by tomorrow and get it returned. Um, because I don't want to have as many books out as I'm about to have out. I try not to have more than five at a time um, and it never works out well. So we'll see. Um, I want this to be too, too long because I know that intro with Bella where our, she was setting up her shop and I was standing in the background giving emotional support basically. Um, it was kind of long, but you can expect to see her in more vlogs. She's one of my few friends who actually wants to be in them. So other than my friend, uh, my, my other best friend, Philip, who was like, we doing, we doing cameos now? All right, I'm flying down to Texas. So that was really cute. I love the support. Um, my other best friend was like, more Cotter content. And I'm like, no, love my puppy, but no. I'm gonna try and film this week the dad books video. I'm gonna film the dad books for Chronicles of Amber so that I can express my concerns with dad. And then <laughs> I will be reading the second Chronicles of Amber book for February. Um, by second, I mean the second volume. I don't know what books it has in there. I don't know how many, if it's two or three, but uh, yeah. So you guys can look forward to that, to seeing my dad, possibly my mom. My dad plays Santa, so please do not be surprised. Maybe I'll put a picture of him and I here. I also play his elf and have done so for 10 years. So it has been a hard week. Um, I've, you know, having only finished three books this week, that's kind of um, not my normal jam. That's not my normal, uh, I, I do better. I normally finish like six books a week and this week was kind of slow. I have not had the energy to read at work and I've been busy at work doing things. And so on top of not feeling well, but hopefully next week will be better. Um, you will also more than likely in the next vlog see more Bella because she might be tattooing me. So, yep, hope you guys liked her because I'm going to have more of her in my next vlog. So I'm going to go into the library now so that people can stop staring at me like I am a psycho. Um, this might be my last update. So I hope you guys have a great rest of your week. I will see you guys next time, next Tuesday. Um, bye. Remember like five minutes ago when I was like, I only like to have like four books out at a time. I have five books out now. It's fine. It's fine. So we got, this is the wrong book. I just realized that this is the fourth book and I need the third book. So we have City of Fallen Angels, which I can't read yet. Fucked up on that one finale yay the last legend or the last car of all book i'm so excited girls with sharp sticks by suzanne young i don't know anything about this book other than the fact that amazon and uh goodreads and stuff um keep yelling at me to read it and so we're gonna and the secret history by donna tart i have heard some people say that this book is very bad. Um, this was a gift to somebody. <laughs> um, I have also heard that it is very good dark academia. We will see, shall we? I have to switch up the monotony of YA series. They're not monotonous. It's just like when you read one or 10 at the same time, they start to all feel the same. Um, so I have to break that up a bit by getting an adult book every once in a while that is not a part of a series. So I'm gonna head back to my friend's work, hang out there, finish some reading, hopefully. Am I gonna end up accidentally on purpose starting one of these books that are not the books I'm supposed to start instead of uh, Legendary in, in the Carvel series? Yes, 
I'm just gonna go ahead and say yes. All right, for real this time, I'm out. I'll see you guys at a later date. Bye.